Hello guys, I try to salute. So Peter B they can't cry out now. Peter B is really crying out now. He said there is a plot against him, a very serious plot against him. Guys, when I know anytime when they talk this, eh, before you know, we'll go hear something, before we know, we'll see something. So this one don't come out, can't talk again. And it's the thing, eh, he don't they worry most Nigerians, you know. But I go let you know, I'm gonna just watch the video. This one he talk about Monday for in Twitter and do nine come come drop. The tweet so make a let you now watch this um video and then after that we'll come come back make a come talk waiting and get to talk because me i just feel say as a nigerian you understand you did entitled to contest for the highest office of that country even me myself you where they watch me you have the right you understand so that one will come become it shouldn't be an issue you know he don't say he win election they're saying go court you know he don't go court so why all this one? Anyway, my let you now watch the video, then we'll come back. Come talk the talk, yes. A series of tweets on Monday stated that he is aware of some evil designs against him and his supporters in the coming months. His statement coincided with the inauguration of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu at the Eagle Square in Abuja. His tweet read in part, I am aware of some evil designs being hatched against me and my supporters in the coming months. Efforts will be made to taint my image. Campaigns of calumny are being perfected to defame my character and diminish my hard-earned integrity. For all Nigerians, this is a time for deep reflection. It is also a time to re-examine our assumptions. Even as we reaffirm our hopes, let's calmly review our aspirations in order to recalibrate our expectations and pin down the causes of our missed opportunities and disappointments. We stand at that critical moment in time when as a people we must collectively come to grips with the reality of our injured destiny as well as the reasons for that injury. It is for us to reassess our plight as a young democracy and identify clear pathways to a better and greater future for us all. I mean, he went on to state various reasons why he mm. believes that there is evil plot against him. Mm. I don't know what your thoughts are. I would love for you to juxtapose mm. both stories. That's Peter of B. You know, this evil plot uh, 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 about him. You know, I've wondered something in the last in couple of days. Why is it that the DSS have never picked any plots against an opposi a frontline opposition party leader in the country? Why is it only plots about to they want to disrupt inauguration and all of that. The DSS only picks. Because for Peter Obi to be able to come out as regards plot like this, are we saying that the security agents don't know about it? So when are they going to come out to say it? That, ah, please, Nigerians, watch out. Too. This man, Peter Obi, must not be attacked or anything. Or this campaign of columny must, mm. must not happen against him. Because he's a Nigerian too. And people that plan evil for him must desist from it. Absolutely. He's done no wrong by aspiring for the highest position in the country. And if we truly want to build this country, and if we truly want unity in this country, let's not forget that Peter Obi has a right like a Nigerian that has run. Absolutely. And his rights must be respected and nothing must be done against him. I would like to put all of this, he said also, in the hands of the DSS. I would like to CC the DSS. Please. State Security Service, ensure that Mr. Peter will be safe, and protected, and nothing happens to him all right. and his integrity. All right. Yes, I welcome all of them back. Now down here, honestly, Nigeria only become an is becoming an increasingly, you know, difficult place to live. You know, a lot of intimidations, a lot of um, if you not belong to this particular um Carcass, you go have to face this, you know, you know, suppose they like that. So I just hope, say, this plot where they get against her, make it just be the normal propaganda where they always talk because they have, you know, they're good at that. And anyone when they talk, you know, people will come out, come put things right, will also come out and then make sure say things they're right. So because I see no reason why it should be a problem, bit of it should be. You know, that saying will be born for some people neck. I mean, what's in people they fear? 
And I don't say Peter P, no be person where they carry security, they carry mobile police, they carry this. Because if you say he no get he hand they clean, if you say he no owe anybody money, if you say, you know, he is doing the right thing. So he's a free man. That's why you know, go see, I know, you know, they carry security, you know, they, you know, carry the drag people about. He don't talk and say, if you not see one thing, eh, about me, against me, where they true, me gonna bring them out. That was even before the election. Say, he go step down, and I'm sure he's still standing with, on these words, you know. If they see anything, then bring them. He go drop this court case. Because I don't say all this way they try to, now because of this court matter for them to drop the court case. But the guy, now you're right. If you say then rob him off a mandate and he get the right to prove him. and he believes say the courts, he will get justice for the courts. So let them just let the courts do the job. Anyway, guys, my leave on but if you just come across my video for the first time, don't forget to like and follow my page NHTVNG, my Facebook page NHTVNG, my YouTube channel NHTV Hangout. Subscribe to my channel, like my channel, turn the notification bell on so that anytime I drop video like this, you'll get a notification. And I beg, let me share this video. Give me a thumbs up for this video. I will see you now for my next video to all my returning subscribers. I appreciate gratitude is my attitude see you in my next video bye bye